During my trip uh, in Bulgaria, I had the most amazing food. Um, and in this video, I'm going to show you the best dishes I had here in Bulgaria. And uh, they're all traditional, classic Bulgarian dishes uh, and some variations of what you can find uh, in the Balkans elsewhere, uh, but all super delicious. And I hope you enjoy this video as much as I had fun eating these dishes. And uh, let's get right to it. Hi, and welcome to my Bulgarian food video. In this Bulgaria travel video, I will show you some of the most amazing food in Bulgaria and great Eastern Europe food tips you don't want to miss. I had some of the best Eastern European food in Bulgaria. Bulgarian food is delicious and best of all, it does not break the bank. Many of the restaurants in Bulgaria are very affordable, the portions are sizable, and you will never leave a place hungry. Here's my top food recommendations from my trip to Bulgaria. This 4K travel video has chapters, so feel free to jump to the dishes you find most interesting. But let's get started with my top 15 of food in Bulgaria and a quintessential Eastern European food experience. A great starting point for any meal in Bulgaria are the amazing appetizers. I recommend to try the mixed appetizer plates that provide a great selection of tasty local traditional food such as stuffed peppers, spinach balls, grilled veggies, grilled goat cheese and dried meats. These platters are so delicious and filling that they can really make for an entire meal. Another traditional food to try in Europe and must try in Bulgaria is a nice veal stew. I had some of the best stews during my trip to Bulgaria and the traditional veal stew I had at Monastirska Maganitsa restaurant in Sofia came in a beautiful clay pot that was sealed with dough and cooked in a wood fire oven. Simply delicious. Continuing with my Eastern Europe food tips, Banitsa might be one of the biggest classics of Bulgarian cuisine. It is made with pastry sheets with a filling of cheese, eggs and yogurt. Some variations come with pumpkin, cabbage or with spinach. But the traditional banitsa is with white cheese. You can find banitsa in every local bakery in Sofia and it's a must-have for an authentic Bulgarian breakfast experience. Bulgaria might be most known for its amazing yogurt, which is said to be the secret for a long life. Iran was my staple drink during my entire Bulgaria trip. It is a fresh yogurt drink that is just perfect for the summer. It is made with yogurt, water and some salt. As simple as that. But the Bulgarian yogurt makes it real special. I already talked about veal stew. Another great stew to have in Bulgaria is beef stew. It's a real classic and is particularly tasty with potatoes on the side. Super yummy. Lutenitsa is a traditional dish made of peppers, eggplant, carrot, tomato, oil, salt, sugar, cumin, black pepper and parsley. It's my all-time favorite spread in Bulgaria and it goes perfectly together with the home-baked bread I was served in several restaurants in Bulgaria. My favorite Lutenitsa I had in a small restaurant in Lovic. Check out my video on Lovic for more details. Tarator is a Bulgarian cold yogurt soup. Cold yogurt soup you might ask? Yes, it's a super refreshing and delicious summer treat. Bulgarian yogurt, cucumbers, garlic, chopped dill, sunflower oil, walnut and a bit of water or ice make the perfect combination. If you don't try Tarator while you are in Bulgaria, you have definitely missed out on a real treat. Here's something special for those who enjoy gay meat. I had a fantastic rabbit stew in Sofia, prepared according to an age-old recipe from a Bulgarian monastery. What can I say? Absolutely delicious. There isn't a more yummy salad in Bulgaria than Shopska salad. This Bulgarian classic is simple, fresh and perfect for the summer. The salad consists of chopped tomatoes, cucumbers, onions, roasted or raw peppers and Bulgarian white serene cheese. The latter is what makes the salad so good. Shopska salad is a healthy bite of Bulgarian tradition. Speaking of cheese, serene is a cheese made from cows, goats or sheep's milk 
Characterized by its tender, wet, and crumbly texture and a fresh, lemony flavor, it is also known as white brine serene. It's made from bacteria that can only be found in Bulgaria and is a major ingredient of many traditional Bulgarian dishes, including banitsa, which we have covered earlier. Kebabce is a Bulgarian dish consisting of spiced minced meat, usually beef, pork or a combination of both, shaped into a small sausage or flat patty and grilled to perfection. The name of the dish is derived from the word kebab, a popular grilled meat dish that originated from Ottoman times. Today, kebabce is usually served with french fries, baked potatoes, serene cheese or lutenitsa on the side. Chicken chavarma is a yummy dish I had in Lovec in central Bulgaria. It is chicken pieces with onions, peppers and garlic, cooked to perfection in a clay pot and served with rice or potatoes. It's a light and yummy dish that is definitely worth trying when in Bulgaria. Since I did not visit the coastal region during my trip, the only fish selection of my top 15 Bulgarian food video is a grilled trout. But I highly recommend you try this yummy delicacy while in Bulgaria. You can thank me later. As you have probably noticed by now, Bulgarians love to eat meat. Mishana skara is a combination of grilled meat in different forms and versions. It mostly includes beef meatballs, grilled minced meat, sausages and chicken. I went for a slightly simpler version and opted for a chicken skewer at Joanna, which is a Bulgarian traditional grilled chain restaurant. You can definitely not go wrong with this. Last but not least, this video would not be complete without covering some of the many delicious pastries, sweets and cakes that you can find all over Bulgaria. Whether you have it for breakfast, as dessert or a snack on the go, make sure you try all the different yummy pastries you'll find here. So here's breakfast. I'm not quite sure what it is, but it's extremely tasty. It is um, some sort of a fried dough pastry with um, a jam filling inside. Very, very yummy. The second thing I bought is um, this um, croissant type sugary thing. Um, I was told it has a chocolate filling. Let's check that out. But this is definitely also very yummy. Mm. Very sweet too. It's not really a croissant, it's too thick for a croissant. It's a different type of dough, but it's very, very good quite filling too. So here we go. These were my top 15 tips for the best Bulgarian food and some of the best Eastern European dishes you can find in Bulgaria and across the region. I hope you found this Bulgaria food travel video inspiring and useful and if you did, please give it a like down below and also check out my other videos on beautiful Bulgaria. If you enjoy tasty local traditional food and are interested in what to try in Eastern Europe, please also check out my other food videos which you will find on my food playlist. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to my channel to get notified about my weekly uploads of more travel videos in beautiful Bulgaria and many other amazing travel destinations. I will see you next week's video. Have a good one. Bye-bye.